Hello, good morning everybody. I'm in Mountain Air's room and this is Jeff and Jeff Hello. is going to uh, tell us about what Mountain Air do and show us a product. Well, we're both here. My mum will tell you other stuff. Uh, the product I've shown is the Glam Tumps, which is a pillow that's used for more than just stitching. So you can see my mom has one on right here. Uh, she's been doing her stitching on. Uh, been great for laptops as well, for reading, gaming. So um, our shop has been blowing these out non-stop pretty much since December and people buying them for stitching and pretty much I would say probably good 98% of the people love them so we've only had one oh, or two people great. out of about 100 people that complained you know just didn't fit them right but um, they basically adjust to size so you just cover it around your waist like a mom has there and you start stitching or yeah. working your laptop. And waistbands are using them and loving them. Also so a really cool thing here is a little <laughs> zipper compartment where you can put scissors or anything in there to kind of stash some of your little trinkets right and how much do these retail for uh, the retail is thirty dollars just thirty dollars yeah yeah they were when they first came out a few years ago they were about 60 yeah. but he's um giving us a good deal out 30 for retail and just trying to get them out there's very limited supply for pretty much this weekend okay. that'll be wholesale yes yeah. so you just put this on your lap yep it just tucks right in your thing i i stitch i love the way it holds my arms so my shoulders and my hands don't get tired. I put my magnet board right here and my cell phone right here. And I'm just, I like it as much or even better than Sleep my lap stand. It's right so comfortable. Oh. It is so comfortable. It's multi -use. And I also put yeah, my right laptop on like when I'm working from home and, I, and I'm in my recliner and I put my laptop on here and my mouse over here and I put my laptop on the side. It works and it's wonderful, absolutely wonderful well that's really interesting i've never seen one before but i can really see how useful they could be um now yeah, so all talk of our about, community loves them talk about so something fun. useful look a man who has been ironing <laughs> <laughs> i'm the fabric guy yes um would you like to tell us about your fabrics as well that would be gary, gary? okay gary, gary tell us about your Here's fabrics i'm sorry Tell us about your beautiful fabrics that you've been hand dyeing. Well, we dye linen and jobelin and it's all, Zygar, it's all Zygar based except for the jobelin. Oh, it's Zygar based and we, we treat the fabric to prepare for dyeing. We dye it and we set the dye and then we dry it. This happens to be a piece of earth and sky. Now, all of our fabric is designed around natural colors of the earth, so we want it to be stitchable with any pattern. Yes. Not so much flamboyant. Yeah, yeah. But subtly vibrant. Okay. Now, a short while ago, you showed me the most beautiful color. Egyptian sand. Here you go, Gary. Yeah, Nicola. Egyptian like sand, and this is uh, spring. spring. Prelude of Spring. Yeah, it's the Egyptian sand that I really love because obviously I'm into reproduction samplers and I could see the, you know, my group of friends who are going to be watching this video are going to yeah. love these colours. Dyes pretty close. It depends on which count and which fabric it is as how the dye will absorb. Right. I really love this color, but there's mm -hmm. also some other really gorgeous colors it's that would that will it's appeal to people who. A lot of dyers don't yeah. Them. This is a Jobin fabric, which is a an even weave for people that have trouble with finding finding uh, the holes. Yeah, yeah, that's really lovely. So. And then you were telling me about your best seller is the sort of sand. that's the how about the um the minty aqua color oh that's the shops have been buying that on the pre-orders when we ran it through the arctic ice arctic ice it's arctic one of my ice favorite colors a, oh, I love there's it. bound to be a, a glacier somewhere in the world this color because <laughs> glacier ice is blue in color bluish green yes well, where I live in Cornwall, when the sun shines, the water is often yeah. that colour. So you could call it Cornish Aqua. <laughs> Thank you, Gary. It's really lovely. And I'm Thank looking forward for to trying by. the... Um, Glom Tom. <laughs> Glom 
some. <laughs> All, All right. right. Life is short. Stitch on. Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye.